to learn about cycling. Today, I will show you four experiments involving light. I will prove you the properties of the Okay, light from the flashlight can only be seen if the holes are in line. Take a look at the third card. When the holes are in line, light appears are the same size as the hole. But, if it's not straight, the only light that appears are half the size of the hole. This shows that light travel in a straight line. For the second experiment is shadow. I put this object in front of the flashlight. As you can see, a shadow form. This proves that light cannot pass through or park object. If this object is nearer to the flashlight, the shadow form are bigger. But when this object is nearer to the screen, the shadow form is smaller. For the third experiment is, I will show you the light can be reflected. Okay, light from the flashlight to the mirror is called incident ray. And the reflected light on the screen is called reflected ray. Why? Because when the light from the flashlight touch smooth surface like the mirror, it will reflect it on the same angle. This shows the light can be reflected. For the last experiment, I will put this ruler into the water. As you can see, the ruler seems to be bent because light change its direction when it enter another medium. We know that light move in a straight line, but when it enter another medium, it will change its direction. For example, light in the air is moving straight, but when it enter the water, so the medium is different and the light change its direction. So, this proves that light can be refracted. Of my experiments for today, I hope you will understand the properties of light. That's all from me. Thank you.